Hey guys, Windows 8 Team Hacks here, and um, just wanted to show you guys how to install Windows 7 on a Microsoft Surface Pro. Now, um, of course, it's not going to be um, gonna be installing over top of Windows 8. It's gonna be in a virtual machine as um, Microsoft actually. Um, put some measurements on um, the surface so then nobody can do that just yet but um, I'll keep you guys updated just going to um, create a new um, virtual machine and then I'll select, um, I will install the operating system later. And then Windows 7. I'm just going to keep it the um, 60 gigabytes. And then edit it. So then there's about 2 gigabytes of memory. Thanks to Microsoft for putting four gigabytes of memory in. And then change the cores to four. It will automatically select the virtualization. And um, I'll select the ISO image now for install installation. I don't think I actually put it in. There it is. Okay, and then I'm just going to remove the floppy and the printer because, well, there's no floppy or printer. And, um, yeah, just click on close and then finish. Now let's just power on the machine. Just select your um, your country and language. Just set up as you normally would.
just press any key. Once you get here, just enter in your name. Enter in a password if you would like to. I'm just gonna leave it empty. You could enter in a legal key here if you want. Um, but I'm just gonna stick with the 30 day um, evaluation. Just change it to your time zone. Just select home network. Now that it has been fully installed, um, I would suggest that you make it so then, um, yeah, just go to this um, tab in the um, VMware and then click on VM and then install VMware tools. Click on install. and then click yes click on next you could select complete or typical or customize. I'm gonna keep it at typical and then just click on install.
Once the setup is complete, it will ask you to restart your computer, but I'm just gonna shut it down. Now that it's fully shut down, I'm just gonna edit the settings and um, and remove the CD, the ISO image, and just make it so then it uses the physical drive and automatically detects it. And then just power on the machine. Now that the VM tools have been installed, it will automatically um, detect the resolution for the screen and put it at 1080p. And um, since it has the video drivers now, you can um, use the arrow effect in the virtual machine. And now you have Windows 7 running on your um, on your surface. Now to activate, you can use an activator or anything to activate um, the Windows 7. only if you don't have a legal key and um yeah that's pretty much it for this video this has been brought to you by windows 8 tm hacks like comment subscribe